this is a video of uh, instruction on how to make your own casting slip from your own clay body so first of all select your clay and make it into a thick slip so you can see it's not dripping at all but it's like a creamy consistency okay for this size of bucket I would add just maybe about two three drops of soda ash so this is soda ash solution so I'm gonna drop about two drops of soda ash in it one two three okay then you stir it well mix it up really well <clears throat> it's still not dripping so the 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 one that actually makes the solution into a casting slip is the sodium silicate or a water glass call it in Indonesia okay just about two drops also don't put too much one two three okay four drops that should be enough and you can see as I'm stirring that it will make the whole thing become very flowy Mix it up really well. Scrape the sides also, the bottom. Make sure the, that sodium silicate really get into every part of the liquid or the slip. And as you can see now, it's starting to drip, it's starting to be more liquid. Okay, I'm going to add a little bit more, maybe two more drops. Two, four. Oh, okay. That should be more than enough, I think. We'll see. Oh yeah, see how it's starting to become very liquidy. By percentage, we are doing it really precisely. The sodium silicate is only about 0.05% of the volume of the slip. So very little. You see that? It's almost like liquid now. And you want that, you see how it's dripping. That's a good uh, slip. You're doing very precise stuff, you need to do the gravity measurement. So you, but for just a simple slip casting, this is how you do it. All right, you just created your own slip casting liquid, slip casting slip.